Hi there crafters, it's Sheila with SheilaStamps.net and today we are using a little lace bundle and this is the card that we're making. Let's get started. Okay, so we are going to bring in our Big Shot. And I have the magnetic cutting platform down. And then I have a piece of Whisper White, and we're using a little lace um, bundle. So we'll run that through. aside real quick. And then I have a piece of Seaside Spray. And the layering rectangles, or the stitch rectangles rather. And we'll run that through. And I have my take your pick, or yeah, I think take your pick. And I got the little brush that coordinates with it. Just gonna run this over really quickly. I'm going to use the other end to pull it up. Right there we go, just like that. Let me clean up my space a little bit. All right, so I'm going to bring in a piece of white paper. And so we're using a little lace, and we're going to be using these flowers, and we're also going to be using So Happy for You. So I'm going to get my embossing buddy and I'm going to run that across. And I have my Versamark. And then I have the stamp mounted on clear block E. And let's see. Let me go ahead and turn it upside down. Mm. 
right. And then I have my white embossing powder. And that looks good. All right, now I'm going to bring in my heat tool. Let it warm up for just a second. All right. And now I have the Seaside Spray uh, stamp pad. And I have the sentiment mounted on clear block G. And I just really wanted the, uh, wanted it to be tone on tone. So just like that. Now let's put this card together. Okay, our card base is also a seaside spray and it's cut at eight and a half by five and a half and I scored it at four and a quarter. Um, our whisper white piece is four and a half or four and a quarter by five and a half, just like the card base. So what I'm going to do is I am going to put some adhesive down in the middle and then I'm going to come in with some glue dots for the corners because I don't want the adhesive to show through. All right. And it's gonna just butt itself up there. And then I'm going to come in with some Stampin' Dimensionals. And I put a lot on here because when you heat emboss, it warps the paper just a tad. So. All right, there you have it, a quick and simple card. Thanks for watching. And if you need any of these supplies, please click on my online store. It's in the YouTube description below.
Bye.